Where are your uniforms? There's no place for me in this apartment anymore. We're not done, Turner. We're not done. I can't lose you and Ruth. You gonna make me beg? Where is Turner? There he is. Where are your uniforms? What's that? Where are your uniforms? My locker. Um, do you want to talk? Yeah, let's have a chat. Are you on duty right now? No, no, no. Okay. I'm, 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 I'm signed in, but I'm... dispatch office. Or is it being used right now? Uh, it's not being used. Well, Slax, I've been, uh, I've been doing some thinking. Okay. I'm Who's kind of thinking, right? Band-aid right off. Oh boy. Oh my god. There's no place for me in this apartment anymore. Come on, man. This apartment's not right for me. It's a tough decision to make. But it's best I open this position up. We're not done, Turner. We're not done. I can't lose you and Ruth. We still can help out with building this police apartment. No, we are you are sex. you are, you are still needed here. You are valued, and people look up to you. No, that's not how I see it. <sighs> I mean, to put it lightly, we're being uh, we're being ran into the ground by a goddamn mayor. He's corrupt and wants his own army. He has no idea what leadership is. He has no idea what he's doing. And ultimately, he has the keys to the department whenever he wants it. The mayor has not been a problem. Hell, I mean, ever since he's appointed the chief of police, he has not been dappel at all with the, with the law. He's left it alone. Um, Dispatch. Of course, because he has someone who he can Tattoo put his hand out. in and control from behind the scenes. Turner, I understand how you feel. But is there anything I can do to change your mind? Because I still, my, I still my believe... My decision's already been made, Slex. I'm here to give you my badge, my gun, my taser, my baton, whatever signed out to me. Uh, don't do the it to me. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not taking it from you. You go give it to the chief of police. Okay, I'm not your boss anymore. And I'll be honest, I'm really sad. You're just as much my boss as he is. No, I, I, I saw you as a football colleague. I saw you as, um, you know, you and Ruth meant so much to me. I learned so much from the both of you from the second you stepped into the PD as far as leadership, maturity, mindset, growth, all that. I learned from the both of you. And to think that, you know, two and a half months later, it could be all just gone and... I don't know. I don't know. It just makes me so sad. It makes me so upset. It makes me angry. Well, was an easy decision to make. What about everybody in shift three? What about everything you've done so far for the PD? You know, walk away from that, Turner, just like Ruth did. They got buried. What about me? I'm a phone call away. Well, I'm not a police officer. I'm a phone call away. I can give you advice. I can help but you. But I don't want you to leave. I think it's the best thing for myself and the department if I do leave. You are not giving this to me. You'll go give it to Barrett, the chief of police. Turner, I I will not accept this. I know I'm somebody else will. Slacks. No. You're taking it. Why? Why am I taking it? I don't know. Hold on to it. Maybe one day I'll come back for it. You promise? I said maybe. <laughs> didn't say no. I didn't say yes. Turner. It's just me now. Ruth resigned. 
You're stepping down? Hell, Olga stepped down too as well. You know, there's, uh, there is some competent cops here that'll, that'll fill those shoes. And I understand that. And I fully believe in that 100%. There's plenty of people, there are plenty of able bodies in this PD. But uh, you're delusional or naive to think that somebody stepping down and leaving such a high leadership wouldn't leave, wouldn't leave big shoes to fill in, wouldn't leave a hole to fill in, w wouldn't, it's just, you just don't replace people that easily. Especially one that are fantastic at leadership, being a police officer. They show respect, they go above and beyond, they're a good person. Those values, those, those core values are so hard to find in people. Well, I think, uh, I don't think that's quite true. Not in everyone's eyes. I, I agree with it. Yeah, but I don't think that's everyone's, everyone's take on it. I, I disagree. I, I don't, Turner, a lot of people love you in Speedy. They do. They really do. A lot of people think how of you. Hell, Clutus was telling me, you know, you'd make a great chief of police. I mean, people see you as somebody who's worthy of being a captain or a chief of police or sheriff because you do have those abilities. You are fantastic. And to hear you say you want to step down just breaks my heart. Especially after what happened with Ruth. Well, even more so now than uh, in the past, I, th I think I need to step down. I, I think I need to make room for someone who is about this this new age department. That's fair, but why are you giving me your badge? Step down um, from being a captain. That's one thing. But to walk this away... This department ain't right for me, Slacks. It's not right for me. It's going a direction I don't support. I'm not going to be part of it. Chat, these guys are reasons, by the way. I just can't be run off to right now. So he's role playing it out. Oh. I've been holding this position up long enough. Now Barrett can make a decision, put someone in this position. People need support. And I'm not providing that support. My, make, my heart and my mind ain't into it anymore. You gonna make me beg? Don't do beg, because ain't nothing gonna come from it. Do you have to get on one knee? That, that's not gonna do anything, Slacks. You know, um, Turner, I haven't said this to you out loud, but um, I've always looked at you as like a father figure for me. Like a father. Feels like my dad is leaving for smokes and never coming back. <laughs> That's how I feel. I'm just a phone call away. It's not the same as seeing on duty. It's not the same as talking to you about what's going on. It's not the same of having your back and going on to battle. It's not the same. You're right. It's not. Can you talk to Barrick, the chief of police? Yeah, I'll talk to him. Okay. You want the, uh, you want my farm? I'm going to give no, it to him. You should give it to him. All right. I'm going to hold on to this badge forever. Who I'm knows? Gonna, Maybe I'll come back for it I'm one day. I'm not going to lose it. It's going to stay here in my locker the whole entire time until you're ready. When that day comes and you walk through the halls and miss your PD, I'll be the first person waiting for you, Turner. you do that thank you um thank you for everything you taught me thank you for everything that you showed me throughout Louis pd Bridget. thank you absolutely you know i'm uh i'm a phone call away if you need me for advice chat why are your tears coming down my f eyes Order. right now uh oh please like uh. i'm not tearing up is yeah, yeah, me too, man. All right. Let me call up the chief. Get him in here. <sighs> yeah. Call him up. I'm going to go find me some napkins. I'll be back. <sighs> I really feel bad for Ice Shot. I really do. I asked myself what would have happened if, you know, things didn't happen in real life to affect the role play the way it did, you know? Clutus.